Hey there, I'm Hannah, your go-to Excel teacher from Sheet Leveler, and today I have an awesome trick to share with you. Have you ever needed to track tasks in Excel like in progress completed or not started, but wished they could automatically change colour? Well, I've got great news for you. Instead of manually typing the status and colouring each cell, which takes forever, we can use a combination of data validation and conditional formatting to make it happen automatically. Sounds good? Let's get started. First things first, we need to set up our drop down list so we can quickly select task statuses instead of typing them manually. Select the column where you want the drop down list, for example, the column where you'll track tasks. Click on the Data tab at the top. Click Data Validation. You'll find it in the Data Tools group. In the window that pops up, change Allow to List. In the source box, type the task statuses you want to use, separated by commas. Completed. In Progress, Not Started. Click OK. And just like that, you now have a drop down list. Now try it out. Click on any cell in the column and you'll see a small drop-down arrow appear. Click it, and you can select a status instead of typing it manually. Pretty cool, right? But we're not done yet. Now that we have our drop-down list, let's make each status a different colour using conditional formatting. Select the same column where you added the drop-down list. Click the Home tab. In the Styles group, click Conditional Formatting. Hover over Highlight Cells rules then click equal to. In the box that appears, type. In progress. Click format, go to the fill tab and choose a color. I'll choose yellow. Click OK, then OK again. Now, whenever you select in progress, the cell will automatically turn yellow. But wait, we're not done yet. Let's do the same for the other statuses. Let's follow the same steps we just did for complete, which we will make green. Then again, follow for not started, which I will make red. Now the fun part, try it yourself. Click on a cell, change the status, and watch as the colour updates automatically. Cool, right? And just like that, you now have a fully functional colour-coded drop-down list in Excel. You can customise it however you like. Add more statuses, change colours, or even apply this trick to dates, numbers, or other categories. How will you use this trick? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next tutorial.